forging cyber. Forging cyber security. Secure Ninja. Hi everyone, I'm Andrew from Secure Ninja. Today it is a beautiful fall day in Baltimore, Maryland. We're at the TechNet Cyber Show. It's 2021. It's been a while since we've been to a trade show and we're really looking forward to it. I might not be the face you're used to seeing on Secure Ninja TV. I'm a lead instructor here at Secure Ninja and I'm really looking forward to this show. We're gonna go ahead inside. We're gonna to talk to some people about the emerging threats in the cybersecurity realm and we're gonna have a really good time. So let's get masked up and we'll head on in there. Hi everyone, it's Andrew here from Secure Ninja. We're at Technic Cyber today and we're at the Tenable stand and we're going to talk to Zach here who's a principal engineer for Nessus and the ACAST product that they support. Uh, for somebody to get into cyber security, what can the Nessus product uh, do to help them in their training and their understanding of cyber security in general? Yeah, so at Tenable we have a saying, right? You can't protect what you can't see. So Nessus is going to give you that basic building block of uh, security, really your fundamentals. You're going to be able to have a view into all of your assets, see what's on your network, what should be there, what shouldn't be there, as well as any critical high, medium, low vulnerabilities that are persistent on those assets and allow you to come forward with a patching plan to get rid of some of these vulnerabilities. Um, so we actually, on the back end, we take 150 different data points from threat intelligence feeds and we cross-reference that against vulnerabilities to say, hey, you have 5,000 critical vulnerabilities, here are the top 300 that you need to be patching. These are things that are being exploited out in the wild, these are things that have a lot of dark web chatter, uh, so on and so, so forth, to really uh, let you come together with a patching strategy for your organization. Excellent. Well, of course we know uh, you can put a network scanner against a piece of hardware, piece of software, you get thousands of hits Absolutely. of vulnerabilities. So Nessus is trying to prioritize what's really important. Absolutely. Uh, you talked about those 150 data points, very impressive. Um, you know, in the cybersecurity landscape, things are always changing. Um, advanced persistent threats, that's something that we're all interested in. Nessus in particular, uh, Tenable Software, who are they tracking? How many really important advanced persistent threats are there out there? Yeah, so we have a massive research team and that's what these guys do is they look at all of the uh, existing vulnerabilities as well as do zero day research, uh, which you'll see a lot of advanced persistent threats using. Um, oftentimes they will be using zero day vulnerabilities. Um, and they, they also don't necessarily need to, right? Some of these vulnerabilities have been out for months that are critical that aren't being patched. Uh, typically major players, we're looking at 15 or 20 APTs. 15 to 20 APTs, yes. excellent, excellent. So you have your ACAS product as well, and you've got clients on the um, endpoint devices. How important is that in the enterprise? So it's massive in the enterprise, especially as we've moved towards a work from home structure. Uh, so we do have agents out there that reside on the devices and that way as devices are transient you're still able to get both your device information and your vulnerability information on those devices without them having to come into corporate or come on the base or whatever they may need to do. Excellent. Well listen Zach, that's all very interesting. It's great that you're still in business. It's great. Your product is great. Um, you provide a um, community-based edition as well for Nessus. So anybody interested in the cybersecurity field will know of this software. Thank you very much for your time Zach. It was a pleasure talking to you. You too. Hey guys, thanks very much for watching. Please remember to subscribe and like because we have a lot more content coming from TechNet Cyber. I'm Andrew Howard from Secure Ninja. See you soon.